My next guest won the Indy 500 last year. He is racing this weekend at the Toyota Grand Prix of Long Beach. Uh, Tony Caron, everybody. Tony Caron. Tony, Tony, it's good to see you, man. How are you? Nice to see you. I, I was glad to watch the beginning of the show because I'm the master of gusty balls, actually. Huh? <laughs> I imagine you sit in a car for long enough, you get vibrations. At and 240 miles an hour, you get a lot of gusty balls. Well, the slightest, <laughs> the slightest little chink in a car door or a little window open. Whoo! Well, but you know, the seat belts, we have seat belts, actually they go, it's six points, and they actually... Really? They've got those seat belts? So they hold your balls. <laughs> Where would a guy get one of these if he wasn't a racing driver? <laughs> but the problem is as you get older, they get, you know. Yeah, yeah, they as start. You know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, no. <laughs> well, you know, you've got to think it's maybe a younger man's game at that point. <laughs> Hey, uh, you're in Long Beach this weekend. Yeah, that's a road race, race, left and right turn. Yes, it's yeah. a street course, which is uh, completely different than the oval yeah. that, that I won. But uh, it's a beautiful place. It's a beautiful racetrack. We actually go around the streets of Long Beach at 200 miles an hour in the end of the back straightaway. So it's wow. Yeah, you know that sometimes happens at the weekends as well. You see that. that. <laughs> sometimes in the local news, you'll see some <laughs> helicopter footage of something similar going on. But I, I thought the chases here are actually slow. People don't like... Nah, sometimes you see a fast one, but yeah, they're... Do you ever watch a, a car chase on the news and go, oh, terrible, no, bad drive? You know, I've, I've always... Uh, yes, and I watched it and I actually like... I wanted to beat that guy just to beat the cops. I don't want to be a bad guy, but... I know, I understand. You know, because they only get you because they call the helicopter. Because right. I want to see a chase that, like, you know, come chase me. Let's see if we can... Well, Maybe we should set that up. Should we? Yeah, look, we set it up, we block off some streets, we, we do it for charity, all right. right? And we say, all right, uh, you take a bunch of money and if you get away, it goes to your favorite charity. <laughs> that would be a good idea. I think it's all right. It. all right. And if you don't get away, the cops get to keep the money personally. Deal. But would you, would you come with me as a passenger? Sure, I'll be, I'll be the guy inside uh, crying. Like, no, like rally, right? You'll be my, uh, the oh, guy I'll that navigates. Your, yeah, left, left, right, left, right. 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 Oh, yeah, that stuff, the uh, road rally stuff they do in Britain. Exactly. That's, yeah. Have you ever done that? No, never that's, done that. That might be quite fun, I think. You need some gusty balls to do that. <laughs> I think that that would be a cool thing to do. And I think we should do that together. We should cross the country. Let's cross Brazil together. Can you imagine? Yeah, During awesome. the World Cup. Are you going to go? No, I'm racing, actually. Really? Uh, June and July is the busiest time of the year for us. So. Oh, man. You're going to miss the soccer in Brazil? Yeah. And, you know... you. I saw it a little bit. You can't really play, can you? It doesn't matter. I wouldn't be asked to. <laughs> <laughs> I can play a little bit. Uh, well. No, I can't. No. What about you? Can you play? No, actually, uh, that's uh, how I start racing. I know. I understand. My dad, my dad, you know, uh, as a little kid in Brazil, it's very popular to... Uh, everybody plays soccer. Soccer. Right? Yeah, it's everybody. It's cheaper. You just need the... The ball. The yeah, ball. That's right. <laughs> so a lot about balls today, but... <laughs> Why would this day be different from any uh, other? <laughs> so uh, he took me, uh, I had uh, this uh, soccer game on Saturday at school, and right. uh, I invite Dad to go watch. And uh, he went, I was seven years old, and after the game he took me straight to the go-kart track and said, uh, <laughs> son, you should, you should race. But uh, I mean, pretty good though. I mean, you're doing great with right. Yeah, now. I mean, I can't complain. Obviously, yeah. uh, he realized he couldn't play soccer. And uh, how's Dario doing? How's he Dario's doing, doing really good. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, obviously, he had a nasty accident. Nasty accident. And I got uh, because of that. You know, uh, Dario is one of my best friends. I know. Because yeah. of that, I got his job at Team Target. So, so he's, uh, a, a, he's a lovely man. He's not going to race anymore now. No, he retired now. Oh man, it's, so he'll be that, here that kind of behavior is epidemic in my no, game as well. Like, even worse, though, yeah. because he retired and moved back to Scotland, so now it's... Oh, really? So he's coming, but he's working with the team. Uh, Target hired him to be my driver's coach now. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. Getting all the secrets. Are there secrets? I thought it was just like, go really fast and don't let anyone else in front of you. <laughs> I wish it was that easy. Yeah. It's like a talk show, you just need to be funny, right? <laughs> You don't have to. You don't have to be funny. <laughs> you just have to be. You know what I, I, my real special skill here is? Punctuality. Wow. 
I'm always on time. <laughs> I, I turn up every day, and they go, oh, well, he's here. Okay. We might as well do it. We might as well do another one. And that's God. it. How long have you been racing now? Uh, 31 years. Wow. And are there any truth in the, uh, the internet and press rumors that you're going to take over from David Letterman? Is that true? <laughs> I thought, actually, you're going to get an upgrade. So Ooh. you're going to move to that, and then I'll come and take your place. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this, is, this is the foreigner show. They, right? they yes, would never let that go. No, I, what I want to do is I want to go to the World Cup in Brazil. That's what I want to do. But I wanted you to take, we could drive down from here. Yeah, I'll hook you up. Yeah, let's do that then. Let's drive to, you know that road that goes from uh, Tierra del Fuego to Alaska? What's that called? <laughs> I don't the know. Yeah, yeah, that. The thing is, Greg, once we get to like Key West, down in Florida, I, I think. No, 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 man. No, no, no. The other way. The other drive? side. No, we go from. Oh, you're going to go the longer way. So yeah. let's go right now because we won't make it. But well, no. Uh, we go to we, we drive all the way. This is I'm not talking about the World Cup now. Here's a, ah, like, it's okay. a buddy movie, right? You okay. and me, the lovable foreigners, right? And we're in a car and we drive from Tierra del Fuego all the way up to Alaska. To Alaska. Yeah. Okay. And on the way we learn about I caramba. Uh, uh, about about ourselves? It's yeah, like, yeah, we we you know it's a voice. You tell discovery. me about Scotland, I'll tell you about Brazil. And, People would love that. Yeah. And, yeah it'll be and then maybe one night, you know, we're in the middle of, like, the Amazon or something, and it's lonely, and we have to snuggle. Are you afraid of big snakes? <laughs> no. <laughs> I've been around them my entire life. Well, um, have you ever been to the Amazon? No, I haven't. You, I, I, if I went to Brazil, I'd go to the Amazon. It is a, a place that I want to go, but I mean, everybody that went thinks it's, it's beautiful. And what big spiders? You frighten the big spiders? I'm not. I'm Brazilian, man. Do you wear a thong? Of course. <laughs> when we go to the beach, it's funny. I live in Miami, so, uh, you know, sometimes I show up in the pool. Not a thong, but, you know, a, a Speedo. Oh, well, you wear Speedos, yeah. really? Well, you I get little nut huggers in the pool, man? Come on! Stuff, it's stuff a little thing sometimes just to show up. You know. <laughs> I'm the race car driver. So. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Why not? Yeah. Do you get any action there when you're doing that? Yeah, from a lot of guys. The opposite. Yeah, yeah. a lot of guys. <laughs> you get a lot of looks, but you know, <laughs> when I, I I told that to a friend of mine the other day. I said, you know, if you feel depressed, just come to Miami or add a speedo to the beach. You get a lot of looks. It's probably not the looks that you wanted to get. Yeah. But. But you get attention. Then. Yeah. They... We're out of time. Are we? <laughs> See, I knew it was going to go fast. Yeah. Can we do the CNN thing with me just Oh, once? yeah, yeah. We can do, I would do a CNN, probably. Yeah. Can we do a CNN? Uh, let's see if we can see. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no. That's terrible. That's terrible. No. Can you put me in the bottom? We're going to yeah. announce our tour to the yeah, world. Yeah, yeah, we are, No, he should have his own. He should have his own. Oh, come on, then. Yeah. And then I'll get this one. Yeah, there you are. There you go. All right. So, have you got anything you want to say about politics and stuff? No, we're going to go on a tour for six months together. Right? We're going to Yeah, we're going to take a horse and a gay robot skeleton. It's going to be awesome. That's, I'm a little concerned about him. Why? I mean, why? <laughs> I don't mind the horse. <laughs> what the hell? What the hell, Vin yeah, Diesel? Yeah, what the hell, man? What the hell? <laughs> you know, Vin Diesel, I'm a big fan of your movies, and this is just <laughs> 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 <laughs>